Hi everyone. I hope everyone is doing good and I hope everyone could hear me because everyone's sleeping so like I just woke up and I'm trying to speak low, you know, so nobody gets up. Um so I think it's 9 a.m. right now. Um and guess what? Today we will be making something. Today we will be cooking with Marissa. <laughs> no, I'm playing. Nobody's gonna cook with me right now. But um, you guys are gonna watch me cook. I'm gonna show you guys the ingredients, what I'm gonna be using to make uh, this. So what I'm gonna be doing is a, but you guys can see by the title, it's a pastelon. So the first time I tried it was, I believe it was like a year ago. Um, because of one of my Dominican friends um, so that was the first time I tried it um, it was so good <laughs> and ever since I was like I want to make that although I know it's not gonna come out the same way it's not gonna taste the same because you know I'm doing it <laughs> and I think it's a Dominican dish so definitely Dominican know how to do it uh, I'm Ecuadorian so it's probably not gonna it's definitely not gonna come out the same so the first time I tried the house, it was so good. So I've always wanted to make one, uh, which I did. Um, I did do it, and it was it was good. My family liked it. I made my friend try it, um, but my friend said that it wasn't as good as how <laughs> my friend's mother did it. <laughs> so I mean, I agree because you know how I said the the Dominicans they know how to make this. Okay. Um, anyways, so here are the ingredients. So this is my second time doing this. Hopefully it comes out as good as it came out the first time. By the way, if you guys are able to hear the fridge, I am so sorry. And um, excuse the mess, but you know, Latina's mom who cook a lot, they have things all over the place, like food all over the place. Um, so that is why you see a lot of things. So the first ingredient is platanos, okay, so I have like 10 of these and another ingredient is the meat, the meat, okay, so hopefully it's a lot because we are five people and we eat a lot and another ingredient, my favorite cheese, mozzarella cheese. We also have a red pepper, we have um, butter, and half of an onion. And we have garlic. These are ingredients that you use to make meat. To, to make this, first things first, we're gonna peel the platanos. So I'm gonna bring a knife and uh, uh, a bowl. So we're just gonna peel the platanos. So, let's go. So I brought this plate so that I could um, put the platanos in here and I forgot to bring the tabla. Alright, we have to go back. So here's the tabla. You know something? I haven't done a regular fiddle. Uh, uh, what? What did I just say? I haven't done a regular video. Um, it's so long, like you guys haven't, like I haven't been myself, like you guys haven't seen like my personality, you know, and this is why, too, I decided to make this video, so you guys could like, did I just really just throw it over there? Anyways, I remember I used to like poke it and then like try to go like this and then lift the skin and then rip it out and stuff like that but then um it wasn't because of one of my dominican friends that taught me that you have to cut this first and then this and then all you have to do is just go like that and then voila 
so the reason why I'm sitting down while I'm doing this is because I don't have my tripod or else I would have been standing up so <laughs> you guys are probably like yo she mad lazy like she cooks sitting down I mean she does these things sitting down so this is the last one by the way the camera is faced my way um, so probably the quality is bad Hopefully you guys are able to hear me because <laughs> the front camera, alright, since I do all my videos on my phone, so usually I always use the back camera since it has like, it's, the quality is better and the audio is better too, but I really needed a front camera today. Alright, we're all done. So here are the platinum. We got 10 of these. And okay, so I know you're supposed to put them in in boiling water. I mean, put them in water to boil for like 15 minutes. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna use them. this pan, and this is our favorite pan. So that is why this pan is like so like <coughs> I don't know used um scratched um so black i would say but yeah this is literally our favorite pen all right so i'm gonna turn it on put the platanos in there and then we will continue with the rest while the platanos are making we are going to we are going to get the ingredients ready for the meat so we're gonna wash this And we're gonna begin. We are going to cut the. You know what? Let's cut this first. Because that is gonna make me cry. So I've seen somebody on YouTube do this, add sugar and oil for the meat. Um, so I'm just going to try it to see how it tastes like. I'm just going to let it melt.
Okay, so meanwhile, the meat is still cooking right now. We're gonna put um, the plantain. I already smashed it. We're gonna put it in here, one layer of plantain, and then I think about adding a little bit of cheese if we have a lot of cheese. And then the meat, once it's done, and then another um, layer of plantain. No, no, no. And then the cheese, and then layer of plantain, and then the meat, and then the cheese. So, yeah. So all of that is just a platano. It's all over. Like I got it in every single corner. Literally just spread it everywhere. The cheese and now the meat is ready so we're gonna add the meat on top Okay, now we're gonna add um, now we're gonna add cheese and then another layer of platano and then um, meat and then lastly again cheese and then we're gonna put it in the oven.